Congratulations on your purchase of the versatile, easy-to-use Multimatic 215 Multi-Process Welder, and thanks for choosing Miller. With your Multimatic 215, you can count on years of trouble-free, multi-purpose, multi-process welding. We know you're eager to try out your new machine, but before you begin setup, please take a few minutes to review important safety information and tips for the Multimatic 215. And remember to wear appropriate safety gear during setup and welding. Now let's get started. First, you'll become more familiar with your new Multimatic 215 through a quick overview of the machine's key features. You'll learn to properly set up the Multimatic 215 for MIG, stick, and TIG processes for a variety of metal applications. For your convenience, you'll also find a parameter chart inside the door, a handy reference that's available for a variety of projects. Let's begin with a quick overview of the Multimatic 215 features. Your Multimatic 215 comes ready to connect with common 120 or 240 receptacles, thanks to Miller's exclusive multi-voltage plug. There are no tools required. To connect the multi-voltage plug, simply choose the plug that fits the receptacle, line up the arrows, and insert the power cord into the plug. Tighten the collar and plug it into the wall. You're ready to go. Power up your machine by turning on the power switch, located in the rear of the machine. Now let's look at the interface, starting with the Auto Set Elite feature. The Auto Set feature makes setup quick and easy. No matter what process and material you choose, you can use Auto Set Elite to set your Multimatic to the proper welding parameters. But unlike standard Auto Set, Auto Set Elite goes one step further allowing you to fine-tune your parameters to the precise settings you prefer. Let's demonstrate how the interface works. Begin by selecting your process with arrows at the bottom of the machine. Choose Flux Cord, MIG Stainless, MIG Steel C25, MIG Steel C100, MIG Aluminum, TIG Lift Arc Remote, TIG Lift Arc or Stick. Next, turn the Auto Set Elite feature on or off. When the Auto Set mode is on, the two blue lights between the plus and minus sign will illuminate. You'll notice an adjustment window appear above and below the center bullseye mark. Depending on the process you select, input your wire, electrode, or tungsten diameter. Then input the material thickness. It's just that easy. Auto Set Elite adjusts your machine to a weldable parameter. Should you choose to fine-tune parameters, Simply tweak the controls for wire feed and voltage for MIG. You can also choose to operate your machine in manual mode. Should you prefer to weld with auto set off, you need to manually adjust your voltage and wire feed for MIG or amps for stick or TIG based on the parameter chart located inside the door. To help you set up gas and polarity for the machine's multiple options, your Multimatic 215 features an intuitive color LCD screen. The screen will prompt you to use the proper gas type and polarity settings for your process. The Multimatic 215 uses understandable word and symbol prompts to flag common issues like loose or improperly installed cables. Finally, let's review gas setup requirements. Your Multimatic 215 is designed for external gas cylinders. Before connecting your Multimatic 215 to an external cylinder, securely fasten the cylinder to a running gear, wall, or other stationary support. To attach the gas to your machine, remove the cap and stand to the side of the valve. Open the valve slightly to allow the gas to blow away any dust or dirt from the valve. Install the regulators so that the face is vertical. Tighten with a wrench. Then connect the hose to the regulator. Slide the hose over the fitting and clamp. Then connect the hose to your machine and tighten with a wrench. Now that you've got the basics, let's take a look at the individual setups required for your specific MIG, STIG, and TIG welding applications. 